What is going on, guys? Ghost here, and today we are back in SnowRunner. Now, we have a beautiful, extremely lifted <laughs> Can Am Renegade. Now, the thing is, there's not a rider on top of it. I I'm guessing, like, you couldn't fit one on it or something like that. But when it comes to weight reduction for a four wheeler, why not just get rid of the rider? I mean, makes us go faster anyways this is a, a beautiful beautiful mod um, I actually seen it on uh, the mods download it's by uh, I think it's a uh, exo frog or froggy like he does some like crazy cool stuff uh, and everything so definitely make sure to check him out but look at this thing like first person's a whole lot better since we don't have um, you know a rider but I like to see this thing go but this is a crazy thing watch this I mean we're an automatic but when we go to high, this thing goes absolutely berserk, and there it goes. This thing's like insanely crazy in high gear. I mean, it it just it just takes off. All right, so we're not going to do that anymore because we've gotten lucky so far. Been air bar up a little bit, but we're going to go take this thing off road now. We had to rescue a truck out in the swamp out here, and then there's a little farm area swamp. So we're going to take this and see what we can do with this bad boy. I, I just, I love Can Ams. Like, I'm a player's person at heart, but Can Ams are just so monstrous. And they just look so good, too. I mean, I'm a big X3 fan, and like the Renegades, they're just, they're just monsters. And they're a powerhouse. I mean, even in video games, they're awesome. But it seems like every time I drive a can in a, like a game, uh, I always wreck it. So, fingers crossed we don't wreck this one. But we'll probably, well, I already did like a couple times. And there's a rock. But I absolutely love like first person with this thing. Watch. Oh, I, was, <laughs> I was going to try to jump that, but it didn't really work out the way I wanted to. But that's okay. It's like you know you're ready, ready to party when you got the big snorkels. Then you see that you're like, whoa! You know it's like I, I've been riding before, and you see somebody stuck, and you're like, that hole don't look that deep. But then when they come out, they're like this. You're like, yeah, um, probably not going to go through it. I remember back in the day when like 30, like I think it was, uh, um, uh, it was 27s. 27 inch tires was like monster tires for four wheeler and now it's like you know they're rolling with 40s and like you know I think I've seen some of like 50s on them absolutely ridiculous this I need one of these heck I might as well I need two of them why I mean I don't know so I, I have I could like park them beside each other we're gonna go try and see how good this thing does in a swamp. I know it's going to do decent and has to. I mean, we are like killing trees. This is the Can Am Renegade Kill All Tree Edition. They kill all tires, kill all trees and swamp. I mean, I should have hooked this thing up to that truck. Oh my goodness. This thing is amazing. We are like boogieing it. Oh boy! I ain't even worried if we're taking on damage. We're just uh, we're just rolling. Oh, it's like some big old logs. We're just just driving over. I love that sound. Oh man. We're just like, it, nope, uh-oh. I think we, uh, we might have found their thing. What? Oh, I was, I was hoping. I was hoping it would sit. Oh, here we go. Wide open. Oh, man. This is it. This is all it's about. Is it bad? Like, I'm literally sitting here rocking back and forth like, 
Left or right? Alright. Let's go ahead and put it low. I feel like we could come out of this. I feel like we might have dug a hole all the way to China. Come on! Are you telling me we're going to have to winch? What? Um, I'm going to hook to that. Oh. Alright, we should be able to... That's a deep hole, so... We're going to back up and... Hit it with all we got, because... I think we can make it over that. Like, I really want to put it in high, but I'm scared that it might, like, start flipping out. Alright, here we go! Wide open! <laughs> I mean, if we put it in low, I think we can. Maybe? Hey, there's like an an actual router that come back up. Alright, let me go ahead and pull this thing back out. To be honest, I mean, I don't know. That's a deep little hole over there. It just, it just sinks right here. How do we go all through that over there and Right here, it's bad. We're not even getting up to the snorkels. The mud is just, I mean. I get through here. I mean, heck. Come on. Wide open. <laughs> it's like we're just bearing it. We're hooking a winch. I'll go it. We are. Oh, there we go. Couldn't make it without a winch. I mean, that's that's the mud because I mean we're flying over a lot of this stuff. Look at this. No problem. It's just that does not have any bottoms. I bet that's deep. Like, oh, it's, it's very deep. That'd be so cool if we could actually like water willy. That would be amazing. Um, I think I want to go out here and play around in the field a little bit. I know we can make out of this. It's just, it's really deep. I'm guessing it's like real gooey underneath. Now we should be able to make it through this field no problem. Yeah. Question is though, can we go over here where it's flooded? But <laughs> Oh, about to oh 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 oh, about to climb up on the uh the hay bale there. Oh man, this is like a, a, a bucking horse. You put a quarter in it or a bucking bull. Put a quarter in it. Oh, I can't believe we actually saved that. Back up, back up, back up. I thought we were gone. It's like a bucket bull, you know. Uh, can you take your eight? Or was it eight second ride? I mean, if you could hold on wide open across here, I'm telling you, that seat would be hitting the booty. I was hoping that would break. I don't think I've ever been. Have I been here? Um, I think. I went up the hill. I'm not for sure, but I'm I'm out to find some good mud. We found one hole we couldn't make it through, so let's see if we can find another one. 
I feel like maybe if we took our time and wasn't wide open, we probably could, because we just dug the ruts out like insanely deep. Um, let's go. What do we have? Is that lookout tower? This is a perfect scout vehicle. Probably not going across the river, but. Is that a... Oh. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we haven't found that one yet. So, can we find a way over there? That just looks really deep. Man, I would love to be able to jump that thing. Oh. There going. Back up! I'm like sitting here like trying to hump a tree. Instead of a tree hugger, we got a tree humper! Back up. Alright. Now, I'm not using my wheel or anything for this because I just felt like I, I really didn't need to be using a wheel for a four wheeler. I mean, I just didn't feel like it. I felt like a control would have been better. I wish I had like handlebars to be sitting here just. Boom, you know. Is that like the road over there? Or is that just. It might be. It might be someplace over here. I'm sure if we go on out, we might find a place to cross. I do like. Uh oh. I do like it because it does flex. You know, even in real life, these don't flex that much because they're just. It's at such a screen. Uh, yeah. Screen. Extreme angle of suspension. I had a uh, a player's razor, and I, I put a lift on. It's a five-inch lift, and I put the lift on the front, but not the rear. Now nobody's gonna be like, "Oh, you had to squat." It actually didn't squat in the rear. It, it helped it so I didn't break axles that much. It actually made it ride better. You couldn't tell the back wasn't lifted either. That's my big thing. I was like, can you tell? But I'd never broke an axle, but at least I had a little flex. Because in front, it didn't flex. Just like a lot of these big ATVs, like, man, they just, you know, one little pothole and it's it. Well, I cannot see. I want to get a first person. Come on, baby. There's got to be a way over there. And I'm going to turn it to daylight. Because I want to be able to see what I'm doing. Um, I want to go up that, but I feel like this is probably going to get a little bit deep. Maybe. Wide open. Huh. Kind of. Not really what I was expecting. Maybe this side. Yeah, I don't know. It looks. Yeah, it looks. It looks a little bit deep right there. Um. I really want to go up that. Over there at waterfall, but. That's a. Uh, that looks like I might be pushing right there. Yeah, it looks. If it's going over snorkel, it just makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> but, uh, we did find the island. I will call this island. Island. Hey, I think we can actually go out here. I don't even think I came up here, but I'm going to try my best. Oh, man. This thing's a beast. I have my best up through here. Come on! Um. Oh, that's deep. I can't find it. Oh, there's a bridge. See the happy bridge. Go toward the happy bridge.
don't die of going towards the happy bridge. Rock crawling on a four wheeler. A, oh, uh oh, a bad A four wheeler though. I'm coming up out of here. This thing is a monster. You saying there's rocks? Nah. I would go over the sidewalk, but I'm scared of this stuff. So I'm going to turn here. I want to go up that river over there. I really want to put in high, but this thing goes like insane when you put it on in high. What is that, uh. As I hit like a freaking barrier, a concrete. <laughs> I hit a barrier! Um. I don't even know where that is. It was down here, so. We just have to follow. First person will get you sick in spin tires. I'm telling you, it's just everywhere. But I want to see my tires spinning. I want to see mud flinging, mud flinging action. It says like mud runner. I call it mud flinger, but it's a snow runner. But I think we fling more mud than snow. I'm telling you, they've got spin tires, then snow run or mud runner, then snow runner. The next one it's going to be gravel runner. Then following up to that, pavement runner. <laughs> Can you find a speck, a speck of mud in this game? We dare you to. I can't believe I ran into that tree. Um, I think I found it. I just want, for some reason, to go down here and turn around come back up it. And this is probably like my downfall here. I can't believe we couldn't make it over from an island. But it just it got real deep right there. And I still want a chance to like kill it. Because if it goes over Snorkel and we can't water really, we're screwed. At least for a brief second we're just screwed. I, I might be screwed now because <laughs> uh, I think uh oh. I'm gonna have to put it in low because it's changing gears on me and it's messing the. Uh... Okay, okay, here we go. Put it high low. Here we go. Oh yeah! Oh man, we are cutting these tractor tires up. Tractor tires do not like rocks. We are cutting them up. They're not really kind of like tractor tires. I mean, they are, but they're they're like intimidators or something like that. I think that's what. Uh oh, I think that's what they're called. I've, I've never ran these. I've actually ran just at BKT, so I know they don't do too good on rocks. I put mine in low when I had them. Put it in low, just let it go. Pulling 35s. It's pretty little challenging because BKTs are heavy as crap anyways. That's why when I get my next side beside uh, I want to go with something else besides but I want kind of tractor style tractor tire style though. Um look we're creating mud. That is awesome. Well this ain't good. Remember when I told you uh, air snorkel get below? I'm hoping eventually we see a boiler. That's a little deep hole there. Come on! Alright, let's back up. We got this. Come on! Oh! Come on! Go, go, baby! We, we cheated a little bit. We had to use a little bit of ground there. It was just, it's slick, especially when you're coming out of the water. Can I get back over in there without, like, tipping it over? Because. You remember when I said I tried to get over there without tipping it over? 
Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure that like button. Make sure you punch that subscribe button. This is Ghost Time. <laughs> Stuck between a rock and a hard place. Oh, yeah. I went there.